guys, it's your design is me. Welcome back to Design is Me Daily, where we design our own clothes, we design our own business, and we design our own lives. And in today's video, it is another Feminine Friday video. I started this series last week, so if you guys are not caught up on that video, definitely go check it out. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started on this look. <laughs> I will be introducing you guys to the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink Liquid Lipstick in the shade 118 Dancer. It is a red lipstick that I have been, I don't want to say I've been loving it because if I'm being honest, I did not love this lipstick from the jump. When I bought this lipstick last year, it's because I was looking for the perfect red lipstick. I feel like I am in my very, very sexy, very feminine, very femme fatale um, red lip era. And so when I bought this, I was just looking for this was the only one that I could have gotten my hands on at the time um, so at first I didn't really like it it's more on the orangey side of red and I am more of a very deep red type of girl but it has been growing on me I used it a couple times before and it has been growing on me if I'm being very honest so we're gonna do a very very basic makeup look today and I'm gonna be introducing you guys to this lipstick feel free to chime in let me know how you guys feel about it let me know how you find the lipstick um looks on me and if you have any suggestions for lipsticks that you want me to try i am still on the hunt for the perfect red i heard about the mac um ruby rose or ruby red or something along those lines um i was actually mentioning it in um a few days ago you guys are gonna see that in next week's vlog next week when next week wednesday's vlog um I used it and it was the first time I feel like I used it correctly but I mentioned that I'm still on the hunt for the perfect red and I know that I want to try the the uh the MAC Ruby Rose or Ruby Red I can't remember the name right now I'll put it somewhere on the screen but I definitely want to get my hands on on that one so let's go ahead and get started I already moisturized my skin um I put on a little bit of sunscreen and I put some chapstick on my lips as well and of course I'm just gonna start with framing my brows I'm using my got to be glue and I don't have a spoolie at the moment so I'm just using a dry mascara brush maybe it's the same thing don't judge me and now I'm gonna go in with the LA girl for conceal in the shade fawn just to quickly um, conceal my under eyebrows. And I'm not using a lot of this at all. Last week, I was telling you guys that I, um, I re-upped on a few of my absolute necessities. So like my concealer, uh, my foundation, the Maybelline Superstay foundation and because I hadn't bought these products in such a long time I did not realize just how expensive everything was so I was telling you guys in my video that the uh, this concealer tripled in price over the last three years and <laughs> if I'm being honest I don't even know how to feel about it I'm tempted to experiment with uh, another concealer since it's you know the price that it currently is i'm tempted to experiment with a few different concealers because more than likely those may be around the same price i mean even if it's a little bit more expensive i don't mind because i feel like i don't know maybe maybe formula is better and if the formula is better and um it's just slightly more expensive than fine but LA girl pro conceal was the ideal like drugstore brand that was like phenomenal but very inexpensive so the fact that it has become so popular that the price is what it is now it's like okay maybe it's time to you know test the waters a little bit I may have 
to fix my brows a little bit more. I may have confused this one a little bit too much. Um, this one. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll just Oh, you know what? Today my brows are cousins, not twin sisters, and they're just gonna stay here the, the way that they are. Because who's gonna check me? Okay, so that is that. Brows are done. Concealer is on for the most part. I already concealed my under eye Louis Vuitton bags. So I'm gonna go in with just a little bit of this foundation. This is the Maybelline Superstay um, Active Wear Foundation in the shade 340 Cappuccino. And I am literally just gonna put the very tiniest amount on selected areas on my face. What I realized is I have not been putting a lot of foundation on over the years. Since buying these products, I have not been, you know drenching my face in makeup i have found a way to really really use makeup sparingly and i actually like the way that it feels like it doesn't feel super heavy it doesn't feel like i'm wearing a mask which is great and that's the whole point of makeup like it should feel so lightweight and so And I think that's the next thing, right? This is why skincare is so important because if your skin is amazing, you don't need to use as much makeup as opposed to if your skin is like going through the <laughs> trenches and you know you're experiencing breakouts, your stress levels are through the roof, your hormones are imbalanced, so you know it's showing on your skin, your diet is poor, so it's showing on your skin. Skincare is so important. And I feel like The minute you start taking care of your skin, I feel like that's the you realize that you don't necessarily have to wear that much makeup anymore. So still a little bit here and there, right? But not you don't need to like drench your entire face. Okay, I'm just gonna put one pump on my neck right there. Just right on this using what is left. There's some I don't want it to like dry and cover that hole. And I'm just gonna spread this. Like the smallest bit. I remember <laughs> so there was a time where I would do my makeup and I would use my foundation and I would start in one spot and I would drag it all the way up and all the way. it was like drenching my face in makeup. I don't know what I was trying to cover, but maybe it was so unnecessary. All right, wonderful. So that is it for the most part. Let me just set my face super quick. I'm using the, this is the Arista face powder. Basically, all of the products that I use in uh, my previous video for my everyday makeup look. This does have a pretty reddish type of undertone, so I'm not going to be using a lot. And I'm not going to be using it on my entire face. I am going to be putting some blush in this area. So this area is like the perfect area to set with this powder. I'll set my under eyes, my eye, eyelids as well. With it. I don't even know if it looks that red on camera. I feel like it does not. It has a red on the tone, but it's not like super red. I feel like I'm over exaggerating. So, okay, I'm also gonna set my neck with this. And I'm just passing whatever's left on my forehead. Great. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go in with just another loose powder. This is a Sasha loose powder and it's in the shade Perfect Tan. This one is a little bit on the, has like a yellowy undertone. So I'm going to put this one under my eyes. I'm not using it too big. I'm just going to set on my eyes with it. And here. And 
I'm gonna tell you, let me take the lash white. <laughs> There's no need for me to interchange with 300 lashes, so I'm just not going to. Great. Wonderful. This is basically it for the face. Everything is nice and um, even. Uh, now let me move on to the matter of fact so let me bake under my eyes and then we're gonna move on to eyeliner and lashes then we're gonna do the lips last i don't have one of those triangle sponges i'm just gonna be using this brush and this powder um, that i'm using is the which one is this i think okay this is the caramel in the shade light I actually thought it was a risk of a second there again, but it's not. This is the Carmia. I'm just pressing it in. I'm just pressing it in. I'm not like gonna, I don't think I'm gonna leave it like to break under my eyes too, too much. Or maybe I will, I don't know. <laughs> maybe I will. to come up really close to y'all. Are on, and now I am going to put on the liquid lips. I'm not lining my lips, I'm putting it on exactly as is. Um, the only thing that I have on my lips is moisturizer, so like a chapstick, my lips are moisturized. Um, what I noticed with this liquid lipstick is that it does stay on your lip for the entire day, for a full 24 hours, it will stay on your lips. <laughs> Uh, basically it'll stay on your lips until you actually remove it and even after you remove it it's like a lot of scrubbing I don't know if that's a good thing um, but it's a lot of scrubbing and you basically have to exfoliate your lips to get it off so okay I do not know if the fact that my lips are moisturized is affecting the way that it's going on I don't know how I feel about this guys. <laughs> I really don't. I saw that it was growing on me the other day. But I feel like I take it back. It needs maybe a little bit of time to dry down a little bit 
I definitely feel like moisturizing my lips change the way that it usually goes on. The last time I wore it, my lips were pretty dry. Like it's the only lip product that I had in the car at the time and my lips were really, really dry. So I just, I, I put it on. Um, it did go on a little bit different. So like right now, I don't know what I feel about this. Okay, um, I'm gonna finish up this look with a little bit of highlight. I did not do any blush, so I'm just gonna do some blush now. Alright guys, so that is basically it for this look. Um, still do not know how I feel about this liquid lipstick. But I told myself it was pretty expensive. I think this retails for about 92 TT dollars and I bought this last year. Like I literally bought this liquid lipstick months ago. I don't know if the price is different now, but when I bought it, it was 92 TT dollars. And in the interest of not wasting, I am going to finish this lipstick but I don't know how I feel about it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more videos like these, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.